What's going on YouTube? Hey, Lawrence Nicholson. Hey, um, I'm in Effingham. I left uh, North Little Rock this morning. Um, I got a delivery. My first delivery this week is uh, Tuesday morning at 7 o'clock in Chicago. And uh, I had enough time to make it today though, but um, th there's no, if you don't get to the Chicago area by 4 o'clock, you're not going to find no parking. So I figure I'll stop at Effingham to, um, to get a little rest and just get up early around by like 3 o'clock in the morning, 3.30 in the morning, head to Chicago. Should get there right before rush hour. Um, I'm going to deliver right off of Dan Ryan off of, I think, 74th Street. Um, well, that's about it right there. Hey, last week, recap last week, I only did 2,100. And 31 miles last week. Um, a little slow last week. It's it wasn't slow at Mavericks, just where they send you at. For uh, where they send you at the load at, you know, uh, had that granite on board. Which you, I showed some pictures of it. Just they're a little. It's not slow there. They they load you though, but it's just a time-consuming process to get it loaded. And you have to drive a little slower with a load like that. And um, another thing that worked out real well for me last week, that granite had a crack in it and a couple of sheets. But uh, I videotaped it, and that really helped me out a lot. So uh, when you're carrying a high, buy, high high dollar load, it's good to take pictures of it. And because they loaded it wrong, it should have been flush against the A-frame. It was out about an inch or so, so they gave it. So when I strapped it down, I put pressure on the uh, on the granite and marble, so um, that it got a crack in it. So, but it was not my fault. Uh, they said that it was the people who loaded the uh, at the other plant. So I'd have to, you know, call claims or nothing like that, trying to uh, explain what happened to the uh, granite. But I always take pictures of your load. Uh, on most of the really it really helps you out a lot when you get in a uh, when something happens to the uh, to the load on the way to the uh, cosignee. Uh, what else I'm going to say? Uh, everything else going pretty good. Just hey, just trying to. I'm at Effingham at the Flying J, and I've um, been here for about three hours. You have three hours and 56 minutes of remaining drive time. I got enough time, like to say, to make it Chicago, but there's nowhere to park in it. And the uh, shipper where I'm going at, the Cosani where I'm going at, doesn't have any uh, overnight parking. So I just drive three hours, three hours and 15 minutes in the morning to the uh, place where I'm going to get unloaded. And i uh, try to get a load going back south tomorrow morning. Anyway, hey, just want to give a quick update. Uh, I got steel bar on board, and um, that's about it. Just want to say, had a nice weekend, and um, hey, it's, everything's good. I give y'all guys a call after I get loaded up tomorrow when I'm going to my next uh, location. Guys, take it easy. I'm out. This is I 57 right here at the uh, Effingham at the uh, it's a rock at the uh, Flying J.